Iron deficiency anemia. Iron deficiency anemia is the most common cause of anemia globally, and it is the most important cause of microcytic hypochromic anemia. Microcytic, small red blood cells, hypochromic, with decrease in hemoglobinization inside the red blood cells. Iron. Iron is an important for heme formation in the hemoglobin. So most of our iron are present in the hemoglobin. We have also iron in the form of ferritin and hemosiderin as storage iron. Iron is also present in the plasma, in the protein myoglobin in the enzyme like cytochromes and the catalases. Iron is important for erythropoiesis. Erythropoiesis is the production of the red blood cells. Red blood cell erythrocyte production. Red blood cell production arise from the stem cell. Stem cell inside the bone marrow. Stem cell inside the bone marrow is called hematopoietic stem cell. Hematopoietic stem cell give rise to normoplast, normoplast or nucleated red blood cells. You can see all of these are nucleated red blood cells or immature red blood cells. Immature red blood cells are called normoplasts and another name erythroplasts. Arising of the late normoplast from the bone marrow to the circulation, passing by a transient stage, which is called reticulocyte, reticulocyte, which are immature red blood cell containing remnant of the RNA inside it. You can see blowish discoloration inside the cell. This is reticulocyte and another reticulocyte, another reticulocyte, as we mentioned before, the normal percentage of the reticulocytes in the peripheral blood is 0.52. 2.5 percent then reticulocyte will mature and give rise to mature red blood cells mature red blood cells are anucleated anucleated cells you can see here no nucleus in the mature red blood cells but there is a central pillar inside the red blood cell represent one third of the red blood cells for erythropoiesis or production of the new red blood cells we need hormone this hormone called erythropoietin so erythropoietin which is a hormone for stimulating the production of the red blood cells from the bone marrow so the bone marrow will produce uh, uh, new red blood cells by the stimulating effect of the erythropoietin erythropoietin comes from the kidney by a stimulus Hypoxia. Hypoxia stimulates the kidney to produce erythropoietin. So hypoxia is very important for erythropoiesis. Hypoxia is present in the high altitude or in the decreased availability of the O2 conditions. High altitude like APHA. And also uh, in anemia there is hypoxia. So there is a stimulation of the erythropoiesis as a compensatory mechanism to hypoxia. In order to get the normal balance, normal balance, normal blood uh, concentration of the oxygen, it's called the homeostasis, imbalance of the uh, oxygen concentration, hypoxia, this imbalance will lead to the stimulatory effect and the start of the circle of the erythropoiesis or production of the new red blood cells. In iron deficiency, all the red blood cell indices. We mentioned the red blood cell indices before, MCV, MCH, and MCHC, all of them are reduced. So we can see in the peripheral blood film or in the peripheral blood smear, microcytic, microcytic red blood cells, very small red blood cells. As you can see here, very small red blood cells in this peripheral blood smear, small and hypochromic. Also, all of these are hypochromic, so microcytic and the hypochrome. Hypo means decreased hemoglobinization. You can see central pillar is more than the hemoglobin. The central pillar is more than the hemoglobin in the periphery, so it is called the hypochromic. 
and a characteristic cell uh, in the iron deficiency anemia is the pencil pencil shaped red blood cells. What are the causes of iron deficiency anemia? Causes of iron deficiency anemia, the most important and the most common cause is the chronic blood loss, followed by malabsorption of the iron, nutritional deficiency, or increased demand in certain groups. Chronic blood loss is the commonest cause of the iron deficiency anemia, uh, and the females are common, commonest group exposed to iron deficiency anemia because of the menstrual cycle. So the child bearing females are more common to be diseased by iron or to be affected by iron deficiency. Other causes of blood loss from the GIT like peptic ulceration, uh, the pe uh, person or people taking drugs like aspirin or analgesics leading to gastritis and ulceration and uh, blood loss bleeding. Also patients with esophageal viruses, liver cell failure, cirrhosis can complain from the uh, chronic blood loss and uh, uh, are exposed to uh, iron deficiency anemia. Malabsorption. Malabsorption, like gastrectomy, partial gastrectomy, or total gastrectomy, uh, partial gastrectomy, or by passing the, uh, the stomach in the weight, uh, in order, in operation of weight loss, can lead to malabsorption of the iron and the iron deficiency anemia. Nutritional deficiency, uh, improper intake of iron in food, like uh, vegetarian people, or like the people who didn't uh, eat uh, meat or liver for a long time, chronically. Increased demand in certain groups, as we mentioned, uh, in children, in uh, pregnancy and lactating, and in uh, people taking erythropoietin therapy as a result of uh, renal failure. You have renal failure, no erythropoietin, so taking erythropoietin, erythropoietin uh, will stimulate the bone marrow to increase the production of the uh, red blood cell, so it will lead to uh, increase demand of iron in order to produce new red blood cells.